I think I somehow forgot how to make YouTube videos. Whoa. Anyway, hey guys, it's Sadie, and um, a lot of you guys requested that I show you how to do like a curly pixie. I'm currently trying to grow out my pixie cut. Shocker, I know. But, um, so it's kind of a mess right now, and I've just been getting bored with styling it the same way all the time, so I was like, okay, I'm just gonna try to do other things. So, I came up with this, like, curly pixie. My hair's kind of naturally on the wavy side, but it's not as curly as this, so I'm gonna show you exactly how to achieve that with a straightener. So, anyway, if you are interested in that, just keep on watching, and I will show you how to achieve a curly pixie. Okay, first I take a working spray. Normally you wanna use like a heat protectant, but I don't have one, so I'm just using working spray to kind of help me, you know, create the best looking curls. And then I will actually start curling away from my face. Uh, I prefer doing away from my face because it gives me a little less volume and I don't really want that much volume. And I'll continue to do that around the back of my head. Sometimes I'll alternate the curls um, in the front, I kind of just do whatever I think works best. I don't have a set method of doing this. Like, I'll sometimes do the ones in the very back forward and then curl the ones on the side, kind of going away from my parts. And then in the front, I curl them every which way, so I kind of have little bangs. Honestly, this hairstyle kind of reminds me of, um, a Jane Austen novel style, if that makes sense. <laughs> kind of like um, Elizabeth Bennet in Pride and Prejudice, her little bangs. I think they're so cute. Yeah, I will continue to do that around the sides of my head. And then I will rough it up and I will actually take a little comb and kind of separate the curls a little bit. That way I don't look like Annie from Annie. <laughs> And then I will take my Kenra Texturizing Taffy and work it throughout the hair and kind of mold and shape the curls um, t according to how I like them. And I'll normally spray it with a hairspray, but I didn't do that today because I wasn't really going outside or doing anything active. But if I plan on doing something active with this hairstyle, I usually use some hairspray. And then I just top it off with a headband or you can leave it by itself, whatever floats your boat. And, yeah. Okay, and that is how I style my curly pixie. I sometimes leave it by itself, but usually I put a headband on because sometimes it's just a little too thick at the moment and it's kind of crazy. Or like today, <laughs> it's insane. So I just put a headband on and I kind of just leave it. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that and I hope it was helpful. And I will link all of the products that I used in um, the description. So make sure you like and subscribe if you want more Pixie tutorial videos. And um, I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.